I think I blew the I think I blew the fuse when I um, didn't know what I was doing. I think I blew the 10 amp 250 volt fuse. So now I'm wondering if I can use my newfound skills rather than go out and buy a new multimeter. Um, let me pull this guy out. Pre disassembled for you, the viewing audience. So here's a small fuse, and here's the large fuse. The large fuse is soldered in. My test resulted in the fuse being blown. So here is the circuit board out of the multimeter. This is the, the front side, and the fuse pads are here and here. And on the back side, where I cut out the old fuse, you can see them here and here. Nope, my battery. Okay. Okay, so now I have two, three through holes. They're good to go. This is going to go through the holes. Okay. Those lead plugs are deceptively in my way. Makes it hard to practice a lot. All right, cleaned up a little bit. So let's see if my frugal fix made my meter work. Look at that. Y'all see that? So there we have it, folks. I actually really enjoyed this project because when I got my commercial electric, hey, do-it-yourself, uh, home guy, non-professional multimeter, I didn't really know what I was doing. And now when I actually needed the multimeter to be able to measure DC amperage, it didn't work. Because of my inexperience, I blew that fuse Whoever knows how long ago. I fixed it myself. I know enough about electronics to avoid the switchy switchy and the blowing of the fuse. And I got a spare fuse in case I do it again. Anyway, thanks for coming along on this journey. Have a great day. I love you all.